This is Aaron with ANET Computers from ANETcomputers.com with another possible potential fix for a problem that you are having. HP recovery disk need HP and compact system recovery disks. So if you're looking for HP recovery disks, I might have some information that could possibly help you. You can order system restore CDs and then now you can order DVDs direct from HP at the following location. You will need either your product number or model name of your computer. You can skip to the section, quote, ordering recovery disks from HP, unquote. You can also obtain instructions showing you how to create your own recovery disk. HP also recommends obtaining recovery disks from computers they no longer provide recovery disks for from online auction sites and computer suppliers. The following page includes information for Windows XP, Windows Vista, and Windows 7. And then as you can see, there's a link to the HP recovery disk, which I already have opened. So if we go to, and this link still works. Obtaining HP recovery disks or an HP USB recovery drive. You can recover your computer without an HP recovery kit. You can create recovery disks or USB storage device solution. You can order a recovery kit from HP in the United States and Canada. And then finding recovery disks or a USB device from other websites. Contacting support for recovery disks. So I'll go over this really quick. This document applies to all HP computers and only HP computers. They have replacement disks, as it says here, HP computers designed for commercial use, such as workstations or pro series, use, quote, operating system, unquote, or, quote, HP Restore Plus, unquote, DVDs. To order these types of disks, go to the HP Replacement Parts Store. So that's a separate link right here. Recovering your computer without an HP Recovery Kit. You might not be aware, but on your hard drive, if you have an original HP computer with the original hard drive it might have a recovery partition and there's instructions here you press the F11 key before you try to boot Windows and there's supposed to be a recovery partition and then here's another way you can create recovery disks or you can create a recovery using a USB so if you have a USB stick you can also create a it's basically you're creating the same recovery system as you would that would that's either on your hard drive or by burning it to disk CDs or DVD and then you can order them it's more expensive though these are free options so the first obviously recovering using the recovery partition obviously that doesn't cost you anything it just costs you your time if it works but your hard drive might be become corrupt or you might have a failing hard drive and you might not be able to boot into the recovery partition which is I think usually it says here F10 or F11 keys well then your second option could be using recover burning creating your own recovery disks or creating a recovery USB stick and then your third option would be to order but obviously that's going to be more expensive because that will actually cost you some money ordering a recovery kit from HB in the United States of Canada this is pretty lengthy I'm not going to go over it but as you can see here you have to have your serial number from your computer and then you have to go to their website and then you have to go to the drivers and downloads enter a product name or number and then it you pick out your computer model and you select your operating system you want to recover to and then you click on order recovery media but you, but one thing one caveat mTOR is you want to make sure you have your serial number I don't know of a way to order discs online without your serial number so you have to make sure you, you have your correct serial number on your computer because it asks you for your serial number and I don't think it allows you to order discs without your serial number then you click next and then here as you can see you and is where you enter your product serial number 
enter your zip code and shipping. I think they do charge shipping, but don't quote me on that. And then your shipping address and then your billing address and then click next and then your payment information which would be a credit card and then I guess your final option is if you cannot get if you don't want to pay for them or if you can't get your recovery partition to boot correctly or you just don't want to burn recovery CDs or DVDs you can find recovery discs via either from a third party or I don't recommend that but if you have to if you you know if that's your well it's your choice it's free choice if you choose that route I wouldn't recommend that but if you do choose that I mean they are available I think there are legitimate third party websites and third party companies that might have recovery CDs and or DVDs for your HP computer to restore it back to its original as if it was right out of the box however you have to be careful because some of them might not be legit they might include viruses and spyware I'm not fear mongering I'm just saying it's possible or you might not get the right correct discs whereas obviously to save money you I don't think it's that difficult you just follow the instructions if you're not familiar with how to burn CDs and or DVDs there are free tutorials on the internet the probably the I would say just from experience as a computer technician probably the easiest way for you to restore your HP computer is using the first option that and we'll scroll at way back to the top that would be your recovery partition and that was the first set of instructions as you can see there's not very many instructions because all you do is you hit your F10 or F11 key before your computer tries to boot Windows and then it'll boot the recovery partition and you'll know when you get there because it looks different and then it'll ask you what operating system you want to recover to as long as your hard drive is not corrupt and it's not failing it should work and then also as long as you did not format if you formatted your hard drive let's say you bought a brand new HP computer right out of the box it was running Windows Vista or XP or 7 or Windows 8 well you didn't like a lot of the extra software you didn't want to use up the space for the recovery partition and you completely formatted it well what you did was you formatted your recovery partition so obviously then most likely you wouldn't be able to boot off the recovery partition there might be a way to access it but that's that's a whole different blog post and that's a whole different tutorial but as long as you did not format your recovery your hard drive and then as long as you didn't format over your recovery partition it should still be on your hard drive and you should be able to access it using the special boot keys that HP has so you can always browse to anetcomputers.com for more possible potential free tips and or tutorials to fix your computer problems. Thank you for listening.